can head in one line. Couple of days back, uh, I put up a message uh, in uh, our social media, Facebook and LinkedIn, Twitter, talking about stress. I mentioned resistance to flow in fluid dynamics is called as viscosity. They measure the viscosity, the water, the rate of water flow. If you drop water from the top, how water flows, or castor oil flows, or a thick oil flows. They flow it at different rate. That resistance is called as viscosity. Electricity, flow of electricity, its uh, resistance to flow of electricity is represented by OHM. OH and uh, in our body also, that if some things, if somebody says something, I can't digest that one. That is expressed as stress. Ideas doesn't go through properly. I can't digest that one. And I cannot assimilate that one. And I, it makes, the, those uh, comments make me very angry. That is called a stress. Resistance to flow of energy. And uh, why stress comes? If I am in absolute joy, happy, the same comment, people can tell, talk about uh, some comments, I won't worry because I am in so much of in joy. If I am not happy, if somebody says something, I get burst of energy. So the stress, reason for stress is here within. It is not others' comments. What others say, it won't worry me if I'm in absolute joy. Whereas if I'm sad, uh, unsettled within, others' comments will make me annoyed, agitated. Problem lies here, stress. The stress in the physical level and the mental level, the two levels, the physical stress, if you start lifting the same weight again and again, it's a physical stress. It may have a physical, uh, physiological problem, but it can be repaired. But mental stress is much more deeper. They say in Australia last week, uh, they, say, uh, in, they were saying, Australia spends about one billion, 180 billion dollars every year addressing the mental health stress issues. It is spending about $500 million every day. It's a stress. Stress is affecting. The stress, cause of the stress, where is the cause of the stress? And uh, I take uh, children yoga class also. Some kids, they say they have stress. Small children, supposed to be running around with joy, they also complain of stress. And working people, they say they are under stress. And from uh, this uh, Wednesday, we are starting our new center in uh, Basin, Basin in uh, old age home. Old age home, we are starting our yoga center, yoga classes. And uh, old age home, they say, the, uh, we say we are under stress because we are working. They have no work. They are whole time in the old age. But the main thing bothers them is stress. So, stress is not related to work. Then it proves, it's children, how come they are having stress? Or, how, how come the old people have nothing to do? Still they have stress. So, the problem for stress is nothing to do with the work. Problem with this person. Problem with the stress is this person. I haven't addressed this person so, I blame, the, my reason for my stress is my boss, or my wife, or my husband, or my children. I try to offload my burden, they want to point out my fingers to others for my stress. In fact, stress is here. If you analyze further, why I am getting stressed? The reason for stress, 
the way I am getting stressed, I think too much of myself. I think I am too important. And I, I want to enjoy. I want to recreate. I want to go on holiday. I want to have expensive car. I want to dine out in an expensive restaurant. I want to have a mansion. Always I, I think too much of myself. When I start thinking too much of myself, when others are not playing according to my tune, I get agitated, annoyed and stressed. I think I am the enjoyer. And it says in the scriptures, you can't even enjoy. Even enjoying is not in your control. You can't even enjoy. And we, nothing goes as per the plan of ours. ours. If I eat something, if I in the morning, if I have constipation, digestion did not go according to, I am not deciding how to digest. All I know, what to put it in the mouth. What happens after that? Constipation problem. It is not in my control. I deep sleep. I am not breathing. Somebody is breathing. That is also not in my control. Then how can I claim that world should go according to my plan? Nothing is going according to my plan. Everything goes according to the plan of someone who pervades everywhere. And I am superimposing the responsibility onto myself. When everything goes according to his plan, I think because of me, my children are educated. Because of me, my children, my son has become what he is. Because of my effort, I put on myself everywhere. Because of that stress. In Bhagavad Gita, Sri Krishna talks about Bhoktaram Sarvayajnanam Bhoktaram Sarvayajnanam What is that? Bhoktaram Yajna Tapasam Sarva Bhuta Maheshwaram Sahridam Sarva Bhutanam Jnatva Maam Shanti Mrachati Bhoktaram Yajna Whatever we do Bhoktaram yajna tapasa, whatever austerity we do, we are not the enjoyer, he is the enjoyer. Supreme Lord is the enjoyer. I have a fantastic car, I am not the enjoyer, he is the enjoyer, he has given this one to me. I have a mansion, I am not the enjoyer, it is he is the enjoyer, I am just residing there. Yajna tapasa, bhoktaram yajna tapasa. And who pervades everywhere, Sarva Loka Maheshwaram. He is there in everyone's heart. One who understands this one will get unshakable peace within. Stress no longer will haunt that person. That person gets peace of mind and will experience serenity, calmness, contentment, bliss within. And the, the, in the, it says in the scriptures also, we, when we are stressed, we think we are taking all the load onto myself. And the Supreme Lord, in the scriptures, he says, he has infinite hands and infinite heads, infinite eyes, infinite legs. And he is there everywhere. Offload your burden onto him. He is willing to take the load, on, load from you. Why do you think you are carrying the load? When he has infinite hands to carry the load, why put it onto yourself? Offload onto him. He will carry the load. Then that is the way how to address the stress. Stress is rampant everywhere because thinking of too much. I am responsible for everything. If something goes not right as per the plan, many people they say, because of me this bad has happened. I am responsible. Many people continue to grieve. Even in the old age, they continue to grieve. And the success doesn't happen because of you or failure doesn't happen because of you. You are just an instrument. Don't 
put yourself too big don't think too much of yourself when you start thinking too much of yourself stress starts starts haunting you this message i will be conveying in the old age home also when i go there and um, uh, this uh, elderly people i will be conveying that uh, elderly people uh, is uh, it's a time to relax and count on the good time they had and they had to find discover peace within and in that peace they have to depart not go depart the body under stressful anxiety stress if you depart that is not good for the soul we had to depart the body peace in in peace serenity and that mantra remember that one bhoktaram yajna tapasam sarva loka maheshwaram sridam sarva bhutanam jnatva mam shantim ruchyati shantim ichyati those who are aspiring for stress free free life those who are aspiring for peace this is the way told by lord shri krishna in bhagavad gita left 